Is Kylie Jenner's third kiddo on the way? Is the father Timothy Chalamet? And what exactly has this past Easter weekend revealed? Though the rumor was debunked almost as fast as it surfaced, fans have been speculating online for months that the makeup mogul is expecting baby number three with current beau Timothy Chalamet. Ever since Kylie Jenner first surprised the world with the announcement of her first child's birth, people have had a side eye on her for similar patterns. Some fans think they are showing up now. So the first sign to talk about is the one that really raised this topic to the top of celebrity gossip sites. A comedian claims that he was told that Kylie Jenner was pregnant with Timothy Chalamet's baby by a grocery store employee. What a statement, right? Daniel Tosh is the comedian. You might know him from his podcast, Tosh Show. That podcast is actually where he shared this grocery exclusive story. Daniel explains, I went to the grocery store in Malibu and I was talking to an employee there. I tried to avoid it, but I was talking to this guy and I said, why were you guys closed yesterday? Apparently, the grocery store was closed because the Kardashian Jenner family was using the store as a filming backdrop. At least that's what this anonymous worker claimed according to Daniel. The family needed the total privacy from the public because this was where they, I guess, planned to drop the news that Kylie was pregnant with Timothy's baby. Big news! Telling your family that in the comfort of your own home? Nah. A grocery store is obviously the right move here. Daniel continued his story saying, spoiler alert, this is for the upcoming season of the show. This is the big season finale. This random grocery store person is telling me that they rented out the entire store, shut it down, and then they acted like they were grocery shopping. This was the scene that apparently happened. Kylie reveals that she's pregnant again with Timothy's kid. What a bombshell. What a bombshell is right. I'm not saying that the Car Jenner family wouldn't film this big moment in a grocery store. It would definitely add some drama, and we all know how good that is for reality TV. Daniel Tosh wanted to be clear that he was he wasn't trying to confirm anything, chiming in at the end of the story with, I'm not verifying anything. This is what an employee at a grocery store in Malibu told me. Is there any truth to this rumor? Well, we will get more into it. Daniel didn't even start the rumor, it's been going around for months. Pretty much since Timothy and Kylie were seen out on the town together for the first time, Daniel just added fuel to this fire and got a bunch of bonus listeners on his podcast for that episode. Also, the episode came out April 2nd, not 1st, so this wasn't a messed up April Fool's prank or anything either. Reps for Kylie have since denied the rumors pretty quickly after they came out. This hasn't deterred fans of Kylie's as the last two times she was pregnant, the exact same same thing happened and well we know they lied. We know now that the reason reps and even family members were publicly denying the rumors was because Kylie wanted the pregnancy to be a secret. She wanted it to be something personal to her, which is totally fair. Apparently, the producers of the show didn't even know about her first pregnancy until the end. One of the show's executive producers had been attached to the family since they made the reality TV debut in 2007 and they had no idea. They said they had been told by a family member about it, but that the family will often give out false information to see who's leaking info to the press so they didn't believe it. So reps and family acknowledging the rumors, even if they are denying them, makes some fans suspicious. Another sign is that some fans of the show have been complaining online about the family hiding too much about their personal life. One fan sharing on the social media site Reddit, they're so not open and hide so much from the audience very blatantly so the viewer doesn't feel interested or engaged anymore. Kylie had kept her past two pregnancies under wraps and off camera for the majority of the time she was pregnant. Only when it was revealed to the public that her first child had been born did footage of pregnant Kylie make it to the episodes. So the fact that the store was possibly rented out for the family means that they might be returning to letting audiences back into more personal life events. The entire Kardashian-Jenner team was interviewed by Andy Cohen for Keeping Up With The Kardashians reunion episode. And of course, Andy asked what every Car Jenner fan wanted to know. Why did Kylie keep her pregnancies a secret? Kylie shared, I shared so much of my life. I was also really young when I got pregnant and it was just a lot for me personally. I didn't know how I would bring that to the public too and have everyone's opinion. I think it's just something that I need to go through by myself. That makes a lot of sense, but now Kylie is maybe on her third pregnancy and that might mean she's ready to share some of the more intimate details with fans again. We'll have to wait and see. The news dropped that Kylie Jenner and Timothy Chalamet were dating in April of 2023 and that was met with quite the reaction from fans of both parties. Now almost a year later, there might be another big announcement regarding the couple. Eagle-eyed fans had been keeping an eye on Kylie's social media and noticed in the fall of 2023 that there was about a month where Kylie didn't post at all. This is very out of character for the social media and reality TV star. Users of the social media site Reddit got into a discussion with each other over wh what exactly the lack of posting means and how it could relate to Kylie's possible third pregnancy. Some background, during Kylie's first two pregnancies, she didn't post as much when she started showing and when she did post, it was pictures taken months ago or photos that were taken along 
long time ago made it look like they could have been taken recently, if that makes sense. The Redditors began pointing out that Kylie's fall posting had started taking on this pattern. One user commenting, Kylie hasn't posted on Insta for almost a month, with another backing them up, saying, last post was on October 3rd and it was pictures from her Paris trip the week before. Last post was pre-taken photos that could be suspicious. Another user pointed out that at that point in time, there hadn't been any new photos of Jenner since September 27th. A bit suspicious when you take into Kylie's past pregnancy announcement history into account. Now in the spring of 2024, Kylie has posted a lot. She posts photos of herself at events, reels, videos, Instagram stories, appeared at shows, lots of things in which she doesn't look seven months pregnant if we are going by that October timeline from the previous point. Not to say she can't be. Still fans are not convinced. As stated previously, in Kylie's first two pregnancies, lots of content was shot in advance to be posted later and lots of fans think that this is what is happening now too. There were many comments from fans under some of her recent pictures saying all this, claiming that these were old photos and now comments are off. We'll let you decide whether you think that's a sign or not. Another major photo trick Kylie used to hide her pregnancies was only taking chest up pictures, so she could post recent photos of herself next to the ones that had been pre-planned, kind of throw internet sleuths off the trail. Even now, some of Kylie's recent selfies are all taken from the chest up, however she does serve face, so I can also understand why she might just want to post pictures of just her face. She is gorgeous. Fans were thrown into a tizzy in December 2023 when an interesting Instagram story hit Kylie's social media. Kylie Jenner has a clothing line called Kai by Kylie Jenner, and around December, Christmas time, she was promoting it on her Instagram stories. Instagram stories are something a lot of people will just quickly click through. Well, fans thought they may have received an early Christmas present in the form of Kylie's pregnancy announcement when a photo of a pregnant woman was posted to her story. If you had been just quickly moving through the story, you absolutely could have mistaken the woman for Kylie. She had similar hair, and her phone was covering most of her face, so if you didn't stop to really look, you probably would have spent the holiday season thinking Kylie third child would be here by the new year. In reality, it wasn't Jenner, but instead her friend Lauren Perez, still with someone that wants to keep pregnancy rumors in check, seems like an interesting move to repost someone that could be easily mistaken for yourself. Then, Timothy was present at a major holiday Christmas celebration with the family. He can be seen in the back talking to Kylie at the big Kardashian-Jenner Christmas party. The more serious and committed the couple gets, the more people speculate a little bundle of joy is on the way. One Reddit user commented an interesting theory under a faux moi Reddit account thread regarding the Kylie Jenner pregnancy rumors that were floating around even before the grocery store reveal. When Timothy and Kylie first made their public couple debut, it was kind of out of the blue, and then they were suddenly at a bunch of events together after months of pretending like the other wasn't a part of their life at all. Not to say they weren't dating then, just from the outside it looked really sudden. The Reddit comment in question here was, I think my favorite rumor is that she's already pregnant and that's why they're trying to soft launch everything so fast. According to other fans in the Reddit thread, this situation is very similar to what they remembered happened with Travis Scott, that Kylie had gotten pregnant very soon after dating Travis, and the serious dating started after. While we all love to know what our favorite celebrities are up to, the lengths people will go to just to get a glimpse or be the one to leak big news is truly appalling. Apparently, during one of her pregnancies, someone that was a part of Kylie's house staff tried to secretly take photos of a pregnant Kylie in her home. The world doesn't need to know whether Kylie is pregnant that bad, we're good. The camera caught this moment because mom Chris had to step out for a second to take the call from Kylie that revealed this information. About the incident, Chris had said to have somebody in her own home trying to snap pictures they shouldn't be snapping is really, really stressful. When this news initially came to light, no one knew about the pregnancy yet, but now we know that Kylie would have been pregnant when this all went down. This past holiday weekend fueled some additional rumors, gave us more signs and that some serious steps were made in the Timothy and Kylie relationship timeline. Kylie's momager, Kris Jenner, hosted a special Easter celebration for her, her daughters, and grandchildren, and possibly Timothy Chalamet. The Easter celebration was quite the setup, so of course it made it to the Instagram stories of multiple attendees. In one video posted to Kim Kardashian's Instagram story, Kim was showing off the main table and all of the place settings and little details. In the video, you can see the names on the place cards. Well, all except one. There was one name blurred out, and fans think it was Timothy's. The card was placed right beside Kylie's, and some fans claim they can see a TI. All of this 
speculation was happening on the Reddit page, Timothy Chalamet Daily. Fans were quick to speculate that if it is his name, it was possibly blurred to get people talking about it. How easy it would have been for Kim to just take a video on the other side of the table and how placing the blurred name right next to Kylie was going to stir things up. Kylie also posted very few photos this year from the celebration and her sisters posted everything. You couldn't really see Kylie though in any of their posts either. For those who believe Kylie is pregnant with Timothy's baby, having him at a big holiday celebration with the whole family and keeping photos of each other off the web is looking like a sign. If she is pregnant, congratulations to the happy couple. Thanks so much for watching and listening along everyone. See you later. Bye!